the most beautiful painted horses in the world, American paint horse, thoroughbred stallions, and mares. Most popular breeds to own. While some people consider the paint a color breed, the American Paint Horse Association considers them a true breed as paints have a strict bloodline requirement and distinctive breed characteristics. The American Paint Horse is a breed of horse that combines both the conformational characteristics of a Western stock horse with a pinto spotting pattern of white and dark coat colors. Developed from a base of spotted horses with quarter horse and thoroughbred bloodlines, the American Paint Horse Association APHA, breed registry is now one of the largest in North America. The registry allows some non-spotted animals to be registered as solid paint bred and considers the American paint horse to be a horse breed with distinct characteristics, not merely a color breed. The paint horse has specific characteristics beyond coat color, of course. The breed has been crossbred frequently with American quarter horses, so many are heavily muscled horse types. They are typically very muscular with broad chests, strong hindquarters, and low centers of gravity that give them great balance. They are usually between 14.2 and 15.2 hands, but those with thoroughbred heritage can be taller. The average weight ranges from 950 to 1200 pounds, a bit heavier than most breeds. In the 1500s, Spanish explorers brought the predecessors of the paint horse breed to North America. These horses likely had barb, Andalusian, and Arabian bloodlines and sported distinctive spotted and two-tone coloring. In fact, many experts believe explorer Hernando Cortez brought a particular sorrel and white stallion to North America from which the modern paint breed might be descended. Many of these horses ended up roaming wild across the continent, catching the eyes of Native Americans. They adopted and bred the horses, admiring them for their coat patterns, strength, and friendly personalities. British colonists eventually introduced thoroughbreds to the gene pool, resulting in a sturdy working horse that was highly intelligent and steady on the trail. Some of these horses kept their spots while others were solid in color. When the American Quarter Horse Association emerged in 1940 to preserve horses of the stock type, it excluded those with pinto coat patterns and crop-out horses, those born with white body spots or white above the knees and hocks. Undeterred, fans of colorful stock horses formed a variety of organizations to preserve and promote paint horses. In 1965, some of these groups merged to form the American Paint Horse Association. Breeding stock paints can sometimes showcase small color traits, particularly if they carry Sabino genetics. Such traits include blue eyes, pink skin on lips and nostrils, roan spots, and minimal roaning. The American paint horse breeding depends on understanding horse reproduction. Mare and stallion management is a significant factor in the breeding process. When your mare is pregnant, then you have to need the confirmation of pregnancy diagnosis test. Successful, healthy foaling is the final step of the breeding process. Due to the heavy influx of American quarter horse breeding, some paints may also carry genetic disorders such as hyperkalemic periodic paralysis HYPP, hereditary equine regional dermal asthenia HERDA, equine polysaccharide storage myopathy called PSSM, polysaccharide storage myopathy in paints, quarters, and appaloosas, malignant hyperthemia MH, and glycogen branching enzyme deficiency GBED. The influence of thoroughbred breeding puts some bloodlines at higher risk for wobblers syndrome. The breed is versatile and ideal for anyone who likes and enjoys horses. So the paint horse is right for you. They are lovable and easy to handle for rides. The owners and the riders are quickly making them train and keeps as pets.